So this is the oil feed for the vacuum pump and this is the oil return hole for the vacuum pump. So this is the vacuum pump. We are now going to install the pistons. This piston is similar to the 323 GTR engine, the BPD, where they both have this uh, piston cooling channel where the oil jet, uh, whenever the piston goes down, the nozzle of the oil jet will go inside this hole and oil uh, will cool the piston through that uh, cooling channel. It's a unique piston design unique only to the Mazda 323 GTR BPD engine. The four-cylinder turbocharged engine rally spec by Mazda. And I just found out here when we tore down this uh, V6 KJ engine of the Mazda Millennia that they are similar with the 323 GTR. We're about to install the piston. This is piston 1 nakasulat din sa rad cup. So in a, so this is number 1, number 2, number 3, number 4, number 5, number 6 piston. In a Millennia KJ V6 engine you won't go wrong in installing the piston. Just remember that those two valve reliefs are for the uh, exhaust side, the exhaust valves of the engine. And the marker where there is a R means right bank and L means left bank of the V6 engine and it also indicates the front of the engine. Also in the connecting rod you won't go wrong because there's a guide so it's impossible to make a mistake in installing the connecting rod cup. So the last piston, the number 6 piston for the left bank okay. again this indicates the front of the engine and also indicates L indicates the left bank so this is the timing marker for the Crank gear, crank shop gear. That's the timing marker, and there's a yellow paint here. Also, this is the indicator. This guy tells you, "Nasaan to nandito ng sundan mo lang." Nandito yung timing indicator. And also, the crank gear for the KJ engine is cone. It's like a cone fit. Uh, the more you torque it, the more centered uh, the crank gear is. There you go. Crank bolt. So that's the crank bolt. So this is like 1, 2 piston, 3, 4 piston, and 5, 6 piston.